is Stephen Vegas with LiveInsuranceNews.com bringing you the major headlines from this week in insurance news. Small business health insurance marketplace to be delayed until next year. The Obama administration has officially announced the delay of the launch of its online health insurance portal for small businesses. The online marketplace will not take form until November 2014 at the earliest. This limits the access that small businesses have to health insurance coverage, and many small businesses had been planning on purchasing coverage through the Federal Exchange Network. Homeowners Insurance Organization makes progress in Florida. Florida Citizens Property Insurance now boasts of more than $7 billion in reserve capital after having struggled with financial troubles over the past several years. The progress comes from the organization's efforts to depopulate itself of policies, pushing homeowners back into the state's private market. Several private insurers have taken up the policy shed by citizens, offering rates comparable to those offered by the state-run organization. Federal Health Insurance Exchange website experiences shutdown over critical weekend. The Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services took the Federal Health Insurance Exchange website down for a period of 11 hours during the Thanksgiving weekend. The downtime was required to implement a variety of fixes for the website's technical issues, but it also meant that people were unable to access the site at all. Some are calling the 11-hour downtime a significant setback for the Affordable Care Act and the ongoing problems concerning the Federal Exchange Network. Tennessee homeowners insurance customers advise to review their policies. State officials have recommended that homeowners look into their insurance protection ahead of any holiday travel. Homeowners insurance is not uncommon in the state, but awareness of what protection is offered is uncommon. State officials are urging homeowners to review their policies in order to ensure that they are protected from the numerous disasters that can happen during the holiday season. Health insurance companies flee South Carolina market. Nearly a dozen health insurance companies are leaving South Carolina, according to the state's insurance department. The insurers cite new regulations coming from the Affordable Care Act as the reason behind their exodus. Some 30,000 people are expected to lose their coverage due to insurance companies pulling out of the state's market. That's it for this week's news roundup. Be sure to visit liveinsurancenews.com for active coverage of the issues that matter to you.